Hey, hi, hello, welcome back to my new video. Guys, this is Sambath. You are watching Sambath Samfax Poco X3 Custom ROM Reviews and Evolution X is on fire for Poco X3. It's releasing day by day new version with different different kernels. I really like it. As you can see, version 12, Android version, and version so Snow 6.2.2 Surya 2022 322. It's a latest available build for. Poco X Evolution X version that is on 5th March 2022. That's also a latest security patch for a smartphone. Kernel used here is 4.14.190. Quick Silver Perf Surya kernel has been used, and the build date you can see March 22, and build number also you can see. And Cynic status is M4 Sync. And I have been running the CPU throttling test from last 5 minutes 7 seconds. You can see here. The maximum is 163, average is 158, and minimum is 148. And CPU, there is no CPU throttling has been detected in the particular ROM. That's really good. Not just this. Let me show you the Android benchmark results in this particular ROM. You get 3,60,000 for a Poco X powering Snapdragon 732G. This is a very good score, and 1.1 degree Celsius has been raised during this testing i mean the temperature and two percent of battery has been dropped during this testing of anti to benchmark result in this evolution x latest version and if you want to unlock high fps and unlimited storage in google photos i will show you already people know that but some of them don't know they directly comment down below how to unlock that that's how and let me increase the volume and uh, make it general okay and you will get direct video call feature that's still available and uh, resume call okay but, <laughs> let me do once again and there is a call recording feature but it will announce the other person that call is been recorded that's how the call recording feature is available in this ROM and let me show the Geekbench scores here also it's very good score 504 single score and multi score is 1556 with kernel user is Linux 4.14.190 quick silver puff Surya kernel has been used you can check out there are many builds on this evolution X previous build was also nice before that that wasn't that good and last two weeks before there was one more build that is also very good and this one is also going to be very good i will show you the bjma gameplay then you will understand a lot more better compared to this settings and into this widgets sorry home settings you get all the basic settings notification dot at a glance suggestion and allow home screen rotation that's present here version 12 launcher has been used into the widgets you get all the under 12 widgets let me show you the clock widgets as you can see you can drag here and if you want to change further also you can do it by pressing it and you can adjust them also as you can see that's an under 12 style and this is a under 12 style quick settings panel it's still available and it's working fine in the evolution x room in the edit section there are plenty of options as you can see sync option mic axis and camera axis and if you want anything more like i want dark theme reboot also there is a button and gaming mode always on display off print of options available i directly go here and turn off this sync option and even dark theme also i will disable that this how the quick settings panel new style monet engine style and screen recording feature is it available yeah there is a print of options also and you can record device audio and microphone together you can start recording the screen that's how it is as you can see just tap here it gets stopped and you can view the video of recorded your screen that's how it looks and into the speed test i have here 100 mbps ogo giga fiber connection it's pulling up to 90 to 95 mbps it's fine enough even with mobile data also it's pulling up to 12 15 mbps it depends upon your network location and carrier aggregation support is present in this room no problem regarding that also and i have installed this arno build gcam there is no pre-installed gcam in this particular rom in this version i can say there were some of the gcams 
installed by default but in this version there is no gcam and select xml like this you need to use this add no gcam many people ask about the link dm me in insta then i will get the link of that and xml is already present in my telegram channel with same name sambat sam fx and by the way if you are first time to this channel hit that subscribe button down below it's in red color and also allow the bell notification by pressing the bell icon and if you like the video give it a like guys and coming to drm info and safety net status so it will get passed i already checked it and into the settings into the evolver you get plenty of options i explained it in many videos you can see here into theme you need to enable this black theme then it will be pitch black condition in dark theme and monet engine options are given dark theme icon pack signal icon wifi icon icon shape status bar settings you get plenty of options here to notifications quick settings power menu gestures lock screen buttons animation and in the miscellaneous settings here comes the options spoofing you need to enable this unlimited photo storage then only you will get a unlimited photo storage in google photos and unlock higher fps in games that also useful when you enable that you will get 60 fps or 90 fps in vgm i will show you within a couple of minutes and unlock high quality streams if you enable this i mean in the drm info you get l1 certification this is how the settings into display let me show you the minimum refresh rate and maximum refresh rate and low power refresh rate has been given in this particular rom you can use it and even the colors are also given it kept to adaptive you can use boosted or saturated it's dull type looking colors for me in adaptive if you want you can keep it out that's how it is and all the basic settings like lcd features and display colors you can enable and you can even enhance the colors of your display from here that's the customization available in display and coming to battle life here also it's fine as you can see it has been recorded for good thing here as you can see it's going to be good the battle life and even the performance is also exactly fine in this rom and battery saver you won't get any extreme battery saver and battery temperature has been noticed here and without wasting any time i will go into bgmi into settings graphics as you can see smooth up to 90 fps is available i will enable that that's how you need to enable in the miscellaneous settings then only you get the higher fps count and see in this sanok and sound is also pretty loud you may not notice but it's loud enough okay let's jump into boot camp and also do comment down below guys which is your daily driver for this particular poco x3 which rom is good for you and what is your day-to-day -day usage pattern you can tell to me in the comment section below here we go we are going into boot camp And got him it was helping the 90 fps definitely if i kept to 40 fps i would have gone that makes really difference and the gameplay is also smooth Let's check if any other players are available. Someone is here.
I can't see him for some reason. Okay. Here we go guys again with 3DM with same particular ROM only. Into the graphics also it's kept the same smooth plus 90 FPS only. Let's see how it handles. Okay, I'll come back. That's all the VGMA gameplay and the performance, actual performance is also fine enough. You can see here as you can see in scrolling between multitasking and between the apps and everything is fine here. If you keep to 120 FPS, you will get very good performance and battle life is also fine enough and let me show you the security options what all we get. I need to set the face unlock and fingerprint unlock. I just set the face unlock and fingerprint unlock as you can see the face unlock is very quick as you can see and also the fingerprint unlock let me show you as you can see it's very very fast that's how the evolution x latest version with quicksilver kernel has been used the previous build also very good snappy hot kernel and this is also good you can decide between these two if you want to use evolution x on this poco x as your daily driver you can check one among them that's the conclusion and thank you for watching guys we'll meet you with another interesting video until that keep smiling bye bye for now